Well, from the depth of my heart, I'd like to congratulate Bella and husband Joel. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you so much. As for Demani, my sweet sister, thank you for everything. Thank you for always being there for us. Thank you. Kong's Auntie Bella. Thank you, honey. Joel, say something. Um, yeah. Uh, thank you, Damali. Thank you, everyone. Uh, we can't wait. Yeah, we can't wait. When you set the date, please let me know. I have a perfect trading plan for you. Uh, just a point of caution. Uh, if you guys decide to take up her wedding planner, you have to either have a gold mine or get ready to run broke. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have to say all of that? Uh, yeah, it's just a joke, like friendly advice. <laughs> Wiz, if you want classy and good things, just call my guy, he will sort you out. Oh, oh Damali dear. <laughs> Are you going to be a bridesmaid or a metro? I mean <laughs> given the age. <laughs> if she asks, I can be your bridesmaid any day, my dear. Excuse me, I need to use the restroom. Of course. I'll ask her. And looks like the sauce is done. I'll just go to the kitchen and get some more. Thank you, darling. Thank you, honey. <laughs> Come. <laughs> Dee. It's Joel. just happened. Please leave. Please. Dee, please. Let me in. Let's talk. Did you know? Did you know when I was busy making meals with you? Did you know I was making them for your anniversary announcement? And I was there like a fool. You're laughing behind my back. Of course not, honey. She sprung this on me too. I didn't know anything. I swear. But you played along so well. <laughs> what else was I supposed I to do? I don't know. Please leave. D, please understand. I promise you, my love. I'm telling you the truth. I need to process this. Alone. Please leave. Come up with something. Take your wife home. The celebration is over. I felt like it was the right moment to bring it up. This will help bring both us back into our marriage. I mean, what is so repulsive about you and you involved with your wife? Joel, I'm talking to you. Look at me. I really don't understand why you're mad. You ambushed me in front of everyone. And that was your plan. To get me when I had no room to say anything. So you wanted to contest it? 
Joe, what's wrong with what I said? I mean with what I'm proposing. Why must I be the only one to always fight to save this marriage? You caught me off guard. Can't you see that? Well, someone had to be the man. One of us had to make some sort of move, and I did. Since you don't seem interested, I stood in the gap. Joel, we can't move on like this. I left my home to get married and be happy with my perfect husband, but I am stuck in this sham of a marriage. Oh, really? Am I that bad? Joel, for God's sake, I didn't say anything like that. Am I not the kind of husband you dreamed of? Look, Joel. We might be different people and with different standards, but there are basic levels. But Joel, this marriage operates below those basic levels. Well, then why are you still in it? What are you waiting for? Let's divorce. Huh. That is not what I came to do. To quit? Joel, I am going to fight for this marriage to my last drop. Even if it means emasculating me, shaming me in front of everyone, are you going to build your social respect by eroding my honor? For God's sake, Joe, where is the social respect and honor coming from? Why did you have to announce that we're really And what is vows? wrong with that? Do you want people to think I've been cheating you on you or something? What was wrong with the, the old vows? Joe, you always do this to me. Every time I try to bring out something that is going to bring back the spark in our marriage, you always turn the tables on me. Bella. I'm tired. I'm just going to shower and sleep on the couch. Seriously. Joe, do not walk away from me. Done, Bella. Bella. Oh my God. Are you okay? Is that... Oh no. What have I done? Are you okay? It's the Premier League, all on DSTV. All the goals, clashes, and moments. All of Rashford, Salah, and Saka. The start is getting better. All in the language of your choice. All in HD. Available on all these bouquets to choose from. To watch on all these devices. Get DSTV with an HD decoder plus installation and one month family for 89,000 Ugandan shillings. It's the Premier League, all on DSTV. Because if you don't have a passion for something, then academic documents mean nothing. That's why I decided if I don't get into the corporate world, I'll consider myself a failure. Oh, that's great. I applaud you for that. Uh, corporate world, which area specifically? Because mass communication is an entire world. So who else? Drusilla? Oh, I want to be amongst Uganda's top mm. TV or radio personalities. Mm, you need to be specific. I will shine in either, either field, TV or radio. Oh, I like such drive, so stick to that. Uh, from this moment, all of you, you need to be innovative as you can. Do your research. Be on your toes all the time. That's how we race to the top. We don't use a hot air balloon. We take one step at a time. It's a sweaty work. I'm ready for it all, Professor. That's a spirit I like. Everything seems to be in order. Isabella. Did you have a restful night? Sure, Dr. Emma. That's wonderful. Actually, you're fine. You're out of any sort of danger, and the baby too is safe and doing great. That's all that matters. You know, I was so worried about my baby. 
We needed to observe her overnight, but all is well. If anything comes up, any sort of spotting, insane pain, please rush her back here, okay? Definitely. Okay. Thank you, Chief. Bella. I'm sorry about what happened yesterday night. Please forgive me. You know, Joel, let's not extend that. Just drive me back home. I need the rest. Okay. We'll go and pay the bill. Then we'll be on our way. Accident. I know. Bella told me. Still mad? What do you think? Look, believe it or not, what happened yesterday was just unfortunate. I didn't know. I was just as shocked as everyone else. Joel, it's okay. It has already passed. Well, the way forward is you give her what she wants. She will be happy and she'll forgive you. And then you two can live happily ever after. How many boxes have you counted? 23, sir. Where are the papers? Here. Here, sir. We need to go, eh? I can't be doing this the whole day. I have three more pharmacies to attend to. To Angu, eh? I don't dare go. I love the fact that the professor really challenged us. If only it was easy. Yeah. Wait, wouldn't it be nice um, to have a breakthrough on TV or radio? Isn't there something, a station that could probably take one past your inexperienced student? I know, right? <laughs> But anyways, seriously, you know, you can ask around. I too will ask my friends. I'm sure we'll learn on something. What's that? Well, Drew wants to specialize in television or radio, so the professor advised her to get a station in town where she can be groomed. I'm not just the right guy. Hmm? Unless... There is no unless. Who is this person? Easy. Easy. This is my passion we are playing around with here. I wish someone could be this madly passionate about me. Come on, Yahweh. Tell me. You look so cute when you pose. Guys, I'm here. Please behave. Hmm. Is someone here getting jealous? Go away. <laughs> Anyhow, we're good. So, your person? Mike Cruz at Vibes mm -hmm. FM. He's the program director there. I can talk to him and he let you in as an acquaintance. No way, really? Sure. We can go there, like, right now. Nah, nah, you cut down the Kasigiri, you too. It's too much. Why? You can make a call first and then make an appointment. Huh, that makes sense. You're actually right. Like, look, I'm not even prepared. You don't just simply walk into a place and you say you want to work with vibes. Yeah, that's the point. I need to get prepared first. I can give you some tips, you know. There's a place I know. We could go right there. And I coach you through a demo skit. 
Yeah, do that's the right idea by then. What are you waiting for? Yeah, we go. We go. Uh, Amber. Please leave me alone. This is between you two guys. Seriously, I have an assignment and the professor really wants it. And this is a perfect time for me to finish it. You guys can go. You don't need a chaperone, D. Chaperone? I'm offended. Come on. Then why are you sticking on Amber? Can we go? I parked my car in the chapel parking lot. We can go. Amber, which direction are you taking? You don't really have to drive us there. Uh, my driver has arrived. Uh, we could use our car. Serious? It's okay. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> I thought I told you not to be around me in public. Hey, boss. It is part of business. We have to know everyone and everything in the supply chain. So that in case they run away with the goods, we know exactly where to find them. I'm not planning to run off to anywhere, okay? Good. Because I would hate to slaughter your throats. <laughs> the goods are ready. Our goods will be on the next shipment. Good. You better have my money ready at the drop off. Hello to GoTV's newest package. GoTV Super Plus has all the great channels you love on GoTV Super. Plus, big time international and kids channels the whole family will love. Plus, plenty of live Premier League action on Super Sports Premier League channel. It's the package you asked for and we listened. GoTV Super Plus, available from 1st August. GoTV, love it. Wow. Yeah. Okay. But Ben, why don't you take that boy under your wing? I mean, he's so passionate about this whole shebang. Look, it's not like I do not see his potential or that I don't want to help him. Yeah. But the guy is too young. Yeah, I know. But he's so talented. Yeah, he is, but he still has a lot to cover to get to where you want me to take him. You could start him off when the bar isn't that busy, like now. I'll pay you. Please? Okay, I'll see what to do. You promise? I'll see what to do.
I hope you had a good day. Yeah, I did. Thank you so much. All right. Cool. See yeah. you. See you later. Oh, by the way, Glenn is having a sleepover at Sega's, so maybe we could just drive home straight. I don't think that guy is really good influence for you. Uh, and I, 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 I highly doubt your mother would approve you hanging out with someone like that. You're my driver. You're not my bodyguard. I and I mean, Regan is my friend. He refused to be my friend. So stop judging the people I hang out with. I didn't say we can't be friends. So, it creates a big picture. So, I'm going to go to the next My answer is no. Even if you torture me, I don't want to kill you. 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 As for my sister, I don't want to kill you. All right. Let's go. It's OK. You may leave. I, I, can, I, I can go. Stuka! What are you doing? What are you doing? Surprise! Chichi, what are you doing? Hey, 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 hey. Oh, my, I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a little bit
Netugamba katuje tulie kamera. How did you? Ni masafi na? Ni mbwa. Ni mbwa mungi chini kani. Oji mani? Enjaro. Waji pumira wundi. Mufulu, get out. Get out of my house. Go. Get out. Get out. Get out of my house. Boys. Na 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 kulia. Kulia. You. Yeah. 